this is the kitchen. It's really simple to operate. It's a regular propane kitchen. And you can use it, and we'll be using propane from the motorhome pan. Also, this kitchen has an oven. To be able to use the oven, you have to actually light it from the inside. You cannot use the sparker for that one, as it becomes a safety hazard. Also, you have a hood that it will actually exhaust on the outside, and it also provides you lighting over the kitchen. On top of that, you have a microwave. In some cases, some of the units may have a convection microwave or a regular microwave. In this case, it's a regular microwave. Just keep in mind, one of the most important features of the microwave is the numbers that will tell you if there is power in the unit. So if at any point you don't know if you have or if you don't have power, this will confirm the condition. If you look into the other side, we also have the sink. You can rotate the video if you want. On the other side, we have the sink. And keep in mind, this is a coffee maker. We normally advise people to put it inside of the sink when traveling. Because if you leave anything laying around when you're driving, it will actually fly off. So you got to be careful with that. Uh, the sink is regular sink. It does not have garbage disposal. And of course, always keep in mind that you are not to drink water from the motorhome systems. Uh, the motorhome, although it's designed to be clean and has a water filter in it, uh, we cannot guarantee at all that the water is safe for drinking. So do not drink water from the motorhome systems. That's it. Stop.